Um, am I not getting it? Hi, boys. Phase up. Play this record as frequently as possible. Oh, I hit it, boys. Let's get it. I thought it was bad before, but this is actually bad. Probably my best friends on Xbox. Yeah, like definitely one. Oh, I hit a shot, boys. No more shaving the beard. Let's go. Wait. Oh, let's go with a double catwalk, too. Oh. If you don't know that. Unfunny. I don't know. Yo, I hit it, boys. Why do I want to join FaZe? Well, the answer to that question is a simple one, and that is that it's always been a dream of mine to join FaZe Clan. Back in 2010, when I was just 10 years old, I was big into the competitive sniping scene, and I was actually a big fan of this one team called XGen. I thought one of their members in particular was really dope at MW2, and his channel was named Test Scope. But then, out of nowhere, he left XGen, which left 10-year-old me crushed that my favorite member left my favorite team. I remember going to his YouTube channel to ask in his comment section, why would he leave XGen? And I realized he had joined a new team. That team ended up being FaZe Clan, and that member ended up being the legendary FaZe Fakie. That was over 11 years ago on January 21st, 2011, and I've been a fan of FaZe Clan ever since then. I remember being 11 years old and going to my first MLG event right when MW3 came out. And at that time, FaZe didn't have any competitive teams, but they did have one member attending the event, and that was the leader himself, FaZe Temper. I was such a little fanboy, I remember I had him sign my controller and my MLG bag from the event. And the reason I tell you all this is to give you an idea of the passion that I have for the scene. I've been around in the Call of Duty sniping and trick shotting and montage making scene for over 11 years now, like I said, which is more than half of my life. I'm 21 years old. It's something I've always been passionate about and I don't see that passion dying. I've daily uploaded on this YouTube channel for over 400 days now as well as streamed every other night over on Twitch and I won't be slowing down anytime soon. I still got love for the roots of FaZe Clan and that nostalgia is what I've built my community off of, essentially bringing new people into an old community. Moving on, what would I do with a million dollars in crypto? It doesn't take much to make me happy, especially materialistic things, so I think that my first order of business would be making sure that my family is set, especially my brother who's actually my personal in-house designer who makes my thumbnail for my daily upload so he'd instantly be getting 10% off the bat. As I said, I also have a lot of passion for this entertainment scene, so I'd also make sure to invest in myself to make sure my content is at the highest level it can possibly be. With the remaining money, I would find a cause that I believe in and that I'm passionate about, and I would invest what I had left in that. And yeah, thank you guys so much to everyone who watched my final phase one submission and to FaZe Clan and Moonpay for hosting this recruitment challenge and giving us all the chance. If you guys want to see FaZe NECA or even if you want to see me in the top 100, please make sure to drop a like rating on this video and a comment in the comment section below. Literally any support it all in this video is greatly appreciated and yeah that's about it so i'll catch you guys tomorrow with another banger upload peace out everyone neck out